Idaho's largest university is thriving despite two years of challenges from coronavirus and political unrest. That's the word from University President Marlene Trump today in our annual State of the University speech. But as our Roland Barris reports, Boise State likely has some of its most difficult challenges ahead. Boise State is 90 years old this year, but the last two years have been among the toughest ever, and the school finds itself at a crossroads. I want to begin on a more sober note, taking some time to recognize the challenges of the last few years. The university was attacked by far-right political groups and parents who wanted to restrict the university's mantra of expanding students' horizons. But the third-year president thinks she's found a way forward. It is only when you approach them with respect and care that they can open their minds to see other perspectives and that you can see theirs. The university, meanwhile, is recovering well from coronavirus with a record-breaking $68 million in research dollars this year, along with a record $56 million in general contributions, something that makes hiring top talent in a difficult economy easier. My name is James Satterfield, and I am the new dean of the College of Education. I traveled 2,200 and 58 miles to be here, and it was worth every mile. BSU is worth $1.9 billion a year to the Idaho economy, and while political differences will likely make its job of teaching students more difficult in the future, Trump says it is a time for courage. We want our students, faculty, and staff working on the hard questions, on the intractable problems in spaces where there are differences of opinion, where people do not agree, and being unafraid to go into those places. Roland Barris, Idaho News 6.